I'm going to show you how I installed my brother printer in Fedora 29. I'm using a brother HLL2320D monochrome laser printer with a USB connection. And I'm using Fedora 29 XFCE spin 64-bit. This technique should work with some other Brother printers and with other recent Fedora releases. First, I'm going to open a web browser. I'm using Google Chrome. And I'm going to search for the driver for that printer. Go to the Brother website. And it automatically knows that I'm using Linux. But I have to indicate Linux RPM. And then search. Now it has a driver install tool, but I've tried using that before. And it just doesn't work with my setups. But I'm going to download the LPR printer driver RPM package. And it says read this before downloading. Only installation via the command line interface is supported. That's not entirely true. I'm going to agree to the end user license agreement and download. Now here are some instructions how to install. I'm not going to follow these to the letter. Here are some pre-required procedures for Fedora 10. This is kind of old. Now it wants me to install this library, GLIBC I686. What that tells me is that this is a 32-bit driver and I have a 64-bit system. I may not find that exact library, but I need a library like that. So I'm going to go back, back, back. Now I'm going to download the cups wrapper. Read this before downloading. And the notes are similar to the previous ones. Agree to the EULA and download. So I'm going to leave the website. I put these two files into an identified folder for the printer. So now I'm going to go to DNF Dragora and search for glibc.i686. doesn't find anything, but I know from past experience I'll have better luck if I just look for GLIBC. Now again, this is all stretched out where you can't see anything. So now that it's more compact, what you see is that the 
I-686 version is at the top. Notice that I have all indicated here, not just the 64-bit versions. I'm going to click on that and then apply. Click OK. Enter my password. Click OK. Oops, we're sorry. It looks like a problem occurred. I'm going to try this again. Build transaction failure. Requires glibc common and glibc lang pack. This has glibc common only for x86-64. Here's an older version. I'm going to try this. This includes common and land packs. So that's installed. Now I'm going to go back to these downloaded files and I'm going to right click Say open terminal here. Now I'm going to type sudo rpm space dash i for install hll 2320d l P R asterisk dot RPM press enter. Enter my password. Press enter. Failed dependencies. Perl is needed. Aha. Well, that's simple. sudo dnf space install Perl. All right, now let me try this again. sudo space rpm space dash i space h l l 2320 d l p r asterisk dot rpm that's done now I'm going to try again sudo rpm space dash i h 
L L twenty three twenty D cup asterisk dot RPM. I just have to type enough of the name before the asterisk so that it's unique in that folder. So this seems to be finished. I'm going to pause the video long enough to plug in the printer and see if it works. Now I'm going to go to Applications and search for Printers. Print Settings. Well, it's spotted my printer here. First, I have to unlock this. Now, properties shows the printer. The printer state is idle. Print a test page. I don't know if you could hear that in the background, but the test page is complete. And if I open LibreOffice, Writer, This is a test. Now I'll print and it shows my printer. I click on OK. And again, it works. So that's how to install the Brother HLL2320D printer in Fedora 29 XFCE. This is XRAM Tech. Thanks for watching.